very very early into uh, starting into my pre-place journey i got uh, started getting some uh, interview calls okay. and uh, so i got uh, call from browser stack uh, at the end of january okay. and that uh, process lasted around 2 uh, weeks uh, five rounds of interviews okay and with the help of my mentor i was able to clear all the rounds and uh, i got the job So my name is Divyanshu. Uh, I have been working as a front-end developer for one plus years right now. Uh, I got an internship at Hacker Inc while I was in college, and I worked there one year till uh, August of twenty twenty-three. Unfortunately, I was laid off back in September, and uh, I took a small break, and then I started uh, my placement journey uh, again, my pre- preparation again. That's when I stumbled upon uh, pre-placed. in january i mid january i took uh, i took uh, the men- mentorship of uh, basant bhat okay he is a he is a front end developer at uh, walmart and uh, very very early into uh, starting into my pre place journey i got uh, started getting some uh, interview calls okay. and uh, so i got uh, call from browser stack uh, at the end of january Okay. and that uh, process lasted around 2 uh, weeks uh, five rounds of interviews okay and with the help of my mentor i was able to clear all the rounds and uh, i got this offer i'm joining from from the end of february my initial uh, talk with uh, vasant was uh, regarding uh, some preparation guidance that i needed and mostly about uh, uh, getting uh, mock interviews done okay and uh, i and since i took a long term men- membership mentorship of wasant for 3 months i had planned that if i get placed in between i'll start on my ios development journey also okay so that was the plan and that's exactly how it went i had prepared a technical on my own uh, before also mm-hmm. i cleared all my doubts and some input that i needed from uh, wasant on the higher uh on the difficult stuff such as architecture patterns and stuff and uh, system designs and stuff i got the uh, input from vasant i mean he did his best but that's that's uh, the points that i had really needed help right. and uh, i gave a mock interview sort of uh, regarding the behavioral interview mm-hmm. so that was because th- this was the first time i was giving that round i i asked him to pro- i mean probably ask me questions of that sort and uh, judge me on the basis of the answers i gave he helped me prepare scripts and uh, how to tackle those questions so that was very helpful and mm-hmm. definitely for, i mean uh, without that i wouldn't have cleared those rounds okay and uh, since that is done uh, and uh, the placement is there now uh, we have started on our ios development journey now i had things in mind that uh, i wanted out of my mentorship right so i wanted someone who had 7 uh, or 8 years of experience and but i didn't want really someone who is uh, above 10 years of experience or vastly experience because then i find that there is a certain gap uh, in understanding and level of understanding between uh, a junior developer and a senior developer so i wanted someone who is in who is a kind of a lead engineer and a junior developer so that's exactly what was unfit into mm-hmm. and uh, and the next fact was that uh, he had done ios development in his journey so that was something on my mind from before hand and i wanted that okay there are possibilities that uh, i'm i'm getting into long term membership but uh, there are possibilities that i'll get get a job offer before that so why not uh, i mean explore other domains and invest time in that correct and lastly the fact was that uh, i i really connected with him in my first uh, meeting itself okay um he he is a influencer also he has a youtube channel with uh, 40000 followers and on linkedin also so he really gets uh, what candidate wants and uh, i found him very honest okay so uh he he was very honest about things that he can help me with and things he probably can't help me with also 
so that's something that i liked and uh, yeah exactly that was what was what i was looking in a mentor and i got it sounds great sounds great so did you took trial session with multiple mentor or at the first go you were able to find your perfect mentor i wanted to but uh, i was lucky enough in the okay. fact that uh, i really kicked it off uh, in in the first meeting that we had mm-hmm. uh, all all the check boxes that i had for myself those were ticked so i didn't really go for another mentor mm-hmm. but uh, there are other mentors also and they seem to be pretty well experienced also right right sounds great sounds great uh, and so were you able to get uh, like after the first offer that you got are you still looking for more offers or you are final with that offer i'm not looking for other offers right now mm-hmm. uh, the reason being that it's already been 5 months since i've been unemployed so getting uh i mean getting a job at the earliest is my priority right now mm-hmm. um and also the fact that uh, i mean it's a good offer and uh, it uh, matched and improved upon my previous offer yeah uh and it's a pretty good offer for for entry level developer so i'm not looking for other opportunities right uh the zoom review was done in the first meeting itself in in our first meeting itself and again when uh, okay so the fourth round that i had was director of engineering round and that was a resume walk through round so uh i i got uh, a session with my mentor in which he basically went through my resume and spotted out uh, parts of my resume which uh, could be questioned upon so that was done probably twice and uh, he gave me task uh, so first task was to maintain a status sheet basically and uh, uh, another thing he gave me a lot of uh, questions to and topics to go through in all uh, in all aspects of front end engineering in the sense that okay web security web performance uh, you need to study this html css javascript uh, then react redux and all those things okay. so i had started with uh, all of them but uh, the thing is that uh, uh i got a call very early on and then i i cleared the technical rounds and then uh, i proceeded with the other rounds so uh then my my journey basically changed in the middle i started uh, in a different way but uh, yeah that was the activities that i did that we did together and it's not over yet i have two months to go uh, exactly. we are going to explore iOS yeah exactly. great great so did your uh, i mean did you apply on your own or did your mentor help you out with the referral or telling you that you can apply to this particular company i i mean i had my friend refer to me to browser stack okay um but uh, my mentor told me that uh, uh, he can refer me in companies in various companies and since he has a online presence also uh, right. uh, quite a lot of followers so Uh, he has uh, known people working in different companies so he was ready with the uh, referrals and uh, said uh, told me that he will get, get me referrals uh, fortunately it never came to that uh, i got my i mean preferred job, job before that yeah that's what uh, thing is that uh, uh, there are a lot of stuff uh, available online uh, there are a lot of resources available online past interview experiences but uh, there's not enough time actually to go through each and every of one of them and uh, you really need someone who can probably guide in the most important ways or most important tasks that can be done so in a first meeting itself uh, wasant uh, gave me a, a gave me a host of questions of uh, all the topics that i needed to study there were topics even which i didn't really know that i needed to study and uh, they were asked in interviews and uh, he told me that okay since you are applying only at premium startups and uh, looking at premium jobs uh, you need to know this also this also so all that uh, really helped me and uh, yeah uh, i mean uh, definitely uh, the last part uh, in which uh, i mean uh, after i cleared both my technical interviews i had three other rounds of uh, interviews and that involved a bit of both uh, your past experiences as well as uh, uh behavioral plus technical also mm. so in those uh, in those uh, 
those interviews you need to communicate really well and uh, i mean okay you have done the work now how to put your present your work in such a way that uh, the other person is impressed and decides to hire you so i didn't i had done the work but i didn't really know okay this is of much imp- higher importance in the eyes of the interviewer than this part probably i was uh, highlighting this first then i went back and rewrote my script in my mind and uh, highlighted other portions as well okay. so that uh, uh, sort of uh, mock interview earlier help with wasant helped me in, in that sense okay because i had clarity in my mind okay uh if certain uh, question arises i need to tackle it this way